See you in the corner over there. Suddenly high score. What did you do today? I'll tell you what you will be doing. You're about to laugh. And you see, when you do laugh, I will be coming to your house with two watermelons and I will shove them so far up your arse, you'll be your... Dead. Good luck. By the way, this is a try not to laugh to Randy Marsh Funniest Moments Part 13 from the South Park World. Is Play. That, we're sure this is for real, right? What have you done? You maniacs! What the hell was that for? What? What? Jesus! Can you pass the garlic bread, Randy? Why wouldn't I be able to pass the garlic bread? Dad, where were you last night? What when? Where was I what? Out with friends doing things? Well, I'm full. I'm gonna go work in the garage for a little bit. Work on what? On stuff that do things. Um, oh, I'm gonna take some of this with me. I'm still hungry. Thought you just said you were full. Jesus! What am I, on trial or something? God damn! You guys are really acting strange. So, um... <clears throat> South Park kind of sucks now. You guys want to bail? What? What are you talking about? It's just, you know, used to be nice and laid back here, but now it's all... You know? Like, like now everybody's all... Let's bail. You want to bail, Stan? No, I don't. What's going on, Randy? Nothing! I just... You know, we don't have to live here. We could live anywhere. Last month, all you could talk about was how great this town had become. What changed your mind? Stan? What's wrong with him? You can't just stay in your room all day. What happened, Dad? Everything's upside down. Everyone's taking sides and splitting into groups. Everything sucks. Yeah, everything sucks. Everyone's divided, nobody's getting along, and there's people like your mother who are thinking about voting for a douche because she doesn't have a brain! All right, we're good. Nobody suspects a thing. Take a look at this. We've got everything from PC Principal's hard drive. He was on to the gentrification around the world, and he was convinced that whatever was responsible wasn't human. Not human? The presidential election is only two weeks away. We have to destroy these things. That's much easier said than done. They're resistant to just about everything I've tried. Remember Moff Eisley? Remember the Rancor? Remember? Remember Sand People? Remember the Cantina? Remember the What's going on now? They're using a torch on him! Ooh, are they gonna use a torch on us? Then what? I don't care if they're aliens Jesus. or vampires, we need to round them up fast and fuck them till they're dead. You don't want to fuck a vampire, you'll get hepatitis. Oh, girlfriend, I am well beyond that. <laughs> oh my god. Don't you see what this means? If something not human is gentrifying the entire world, soon no human will be able to afford it. They're what trying the to price our species out of existence. Is that Janner? We can't Is afford it. Is that supposed it. to be fucking... What's his face? We can't Bruce? afford it? All these fancy new restaurants and shops and everyone wants to live here. A bowl of city beef costs 10 bucks now, for Christ's sake. And there's nowhere to shop but stupid Whole Foods. Well, we'll just have to stop going to those places. I had to take out a second mortgage on the house. You what? I had to, Sharon. It isn't my fault. It's the man. Don't you see? The man is pricing us out of our own town. I don't know what's wrong with people in this town. More and more are agreeing with your mother. I tried getting on community message boards and swaying people's minds, but it always ends up with some asshole talking about vaginas and photoshopping a dick in my mouth. That's where we're at today. Everything sucks. There has to be something. Some clue as to what oh, we're dealing with. Sick. The news stories PC Principal researched are also contradictory. <laughs> as if whatever these things are have control over the news somehow. That sounds like vampires to me. We have to find out who had me fired with the Cosby joke. It's the key to knowing what we're dealing with. Yeah, man. Principal Victoria? Mr. Garrison? Caitlyn Jenner? Stan, what the hell are you doing in here? Tell me what's going on, Dad. Nothing. We're just hanging out talking about Coldplay, alright? Fancy. 
I swear I'm gonna need to get a second mortgage on the ranch just to pay my daily expenses. Don't you get it? That's just what they want. Nobody cares about the people who lived here before. They want us to move, because they want to knock our houses down and build more lofts and villas. All right, Randy, you should probably lay off the old vine Chateauneuf to pup. You'll all see. Lay off Pretty soon what? everyone who used to live here is going to have to move. And we'll all be shopping at Safeway again. Not Safeway. Remember Bespin? Remember Wedge? I loved Wedge, Mimby. Ah, there has to be something. Try Stand the acid. Stand on it. Remember Moan Mothma? Remember the rebel transports? They're trying to destroy us. They are? Our whole species? They can't do that. Yeah, they can. Remember the Death Star blowing up Alderaan? Ooh, Alderaan, I mean they. Remember the Cloud City? Remember IG-88? The bounty hunter droid Mimbe? That was fantastic. Damn it! These things are impossible to get rid of. Stand okay. on the motherfucker! What the fuck is wrong with you people? I just oh, saw a new poll that says more and more of you are thinking about voting for that douche. Some of us are. A lot of people like what he has to say, all right? You're telling me that after that debate, you still want to vote for that guy? More than ever. Yep. No! I want to know what the hell is going on right now! What are you doing with that? What are you How's that I couldn't girl? trust you? What are you planning, Dad? Stan, it isn't what you think. Then what is it? Look, I need to show you something, okay? You need to see this, son. Oh, psych! Now put the oh, fucking gun down, bitch! I'm gonna shit. go tell Mom. Oh, yeah, you go tell her. I'll tell her you had a gun. You'll be in more trouble than me. Stan, I am your dad. Put the gun down and sit over there. Mom! Shit! Where has my town gone? Where has... Oh! You like apples? Oh! How you like them apples? Hey, it's Caitlyn Jenner! Check his ass! Principal Victoria? What the f... He's one of them. One of what, Caitlyn? Oh! Did you see the same debates I saw? Don't you get it, Randy? There's people in this country who are sick and tired. Tired of hearing all the rhetoric. Tired of Washington failing us while they pat their own backs. Mm -hmm. Finally, someone comes along who says what he feels. Says That's what why he feels. People like him. Because say what you want, at least he doesn't sound like another politician. Damn it! Nothing kills these things. We have to keep trying. A but where'd they go? They're but. not in the jar. Oh no! That's it. Look, it's over. No, I'll go find more. It's over. Don't you get it? Even if we found a way to eradicate them now, we don't have time to implement it nationwide. Then how do we stop them from getting me elected president? There's no other choice, Mr. Garrison. I'm warning you. You're on the wrong side of this. We're just trying to get answers. You pulled a gun on our son, Randy. <laughs> you pulled one on me first, Sharon. Because you wouldn't talk to me, Dad. Stanley, let your mother and I deal with this. I told you to leave him alone. God, I hate this family. Why are you always taking Why is Stan's everybody side? Got guns? Whoa, whoa, Shelly. Grandpa, Put down don't the gun, you dare pull one eye, You're brother. You're acting like Stan can't do anything wrong. Blah. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, fuck you. Wake up, dickhead. Garrison? What the hell is wrong with you? I'll tell you what's wrong with me. There's enemies to humanity out there wanting to put an end to all of us, and there's assholes like you helping them out. I don't know what you're talking about. Whose idea was it to revitalize this shitty part of town into an arts and foods district called Shitipa Town? All right, it was kind of my idea. I agree. I don't want to be here. Please just let me go. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know anything. I'm scared. I'm completely clueless how to proceed. I just spew bullshit and cry myself to sleep at night. Stop thinking that I'm anything more than a douche in over his head. For fuck's sake, please. 
Shit, I'm starting to really like this guy. She doesn't <laughs> always take my side. You shut up or I swear to God I'll use this. Shelly, put it down now. You don't even try to know me, Dad. I want to, Shelly. I just sometimes feel like you hate me. I feel like you hate me, Randy. I don't hate you. I love you. I need to be a better husband, a better father. We all need to be better to each other. The American people have to be made to understand what's going so on confused. here. You're going to have to talk to them. No, no, I am done giving political speeches. I tried being dirty, I tried being vulgar, nothing mattered! Then for the first time ever, you're gonna have to speak from the heart, and not make it about you. Well, that's just impossible. You know what these things are capable of. Even if you lose the election, another one like you is gonna rise up and take your place. Son of a bitch. What, to take one area of town that was crappy and gentrified for the local people to enjoy? I thought we could keep it contained! It doesn't contain. What's happened to South Park is happening everywhere. 30 miles Jesus. south of here in a town of Fair Play, they've changed an area north of downtown into Nodo Fopa. A rundown area south of the capital in Cheyenne, Wyoming is now historic Soka Chewo. Channel Street in mid-Chicago is being revitalized into Chimichanga. Oh my god. Do you want what to explain to me what Hell pussy you crushing doing, is? Randy? What? Your little meetings you go to at night to discuss social justice? It's just a way to pick up on young women? Sharon, most of the guys in my PC club are right out of college, right? You know how college kids are? Who wrote this? I don't want you going over there anymore! I don't cheat on you, Sharon! I'm happy! Look at what's happened to our town! We have Shitipa Town! Boutique restaurants and artisan shops! We have a fucking Whole Foods! And that was all me! Diverse people are moving here. Everyone's being aware of how they talk. This is paradise, Sharon. Is paradise. It? All I know is that you've changed. Ever since you joined this PC thing, you just bully people and wait for people to say anything improper so that you can jump down their throats for whatever words he or she used. He or she is an agenderphobic microaggression, Sharon. Fuck. You are sick. a bigot. It may seem fun to go back and recycle the past we loved, but we end up with no sustenance. I thought you were going to explain why people want a guy like me to be president. Well, that's important too, I guess, but it's just a symptom of the same thing. See, when a civilization has become so big, it starts to get lazy. And that's when you get member berries. They're nothing new. They date back all the way to the Roman Empire. Once too many Romans ate the member berries, there was no more growth. Oh, I remember Bionic Man. Oh, I remember. I want the punch. Oh, I, I want the punch. Bionic Man. Remember Chewbacca again? Oh, I love to remember Chewbacca. Well, I guess there's just one last uh -huh. thing to take care of. Why did it have to be like this? Why couldn't we try to live on this planet together? Maybe we're not perfect beings, but we built a better town. We didn't need you to do that, and we'll keep on trying to make it better. Nice, Randy. I feel like I should stand up and applaud that. Gerald, hey, come on in. You're not alone, bud. We're all facing the same struggles and trying to do something about it. Anyway, please continue, Richard. Well, like I was saying, I've been addicted to member berries for about two months now. It's okay, man. You're not alone. It's just, you know, membering is so much more fun than thinking. I want so bad to go back when things were good. When I was a kid, you know, like the 80s and the 90s and things made sense, you know? And that's how we Tree. got here to this very member berry election. What is Tree. this? What have been your struggles with member berries, Gerald? I don't even know what a member. Remember the Digabuses thing? Oh, I love Digabuses. That's where Yoda lives. Remember Yoda? <coughs> Michael, are there member berries in your pocket? Oh, remember Carillion Corvette? I remember Carillion Corvette. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Ock. Anyway, Gerald, what is your experience? You been? evil bastard. I don't even know what member berries are. Gerald, come on. The first step towards healing is admitting you've got a problem. Yeah? You've got a fat pussy, and you should go and fucking kill yourself! <laughs>
Sorry, I, I think I'm in the wrong place. They rested on their laurels just what eating the and hell numbering all for? the good stuff. I think those are just Jesus. great. Jesus! Thought so too, till I zoomed in. Maybe. You see, we all want to go back to when we were kids. Simple ideas like a big man to protect us, keep us safe. Instead of a fresh new Star Wars, we want the old. Just recycled and plopped in our tummies. You almost make it sound like J.J. Abrams is responsible for this entire election. Does this look familiar? Hey, remember when there weren't so many Mexicans? Oh, I remember. Wait, what? Yeah, 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 remember when marriage was just between a man and a woman? I remember. Oh, I remember. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, I remember that. Wait. Remember feeling safe? Remember no ice? Remember Reagan? Oh, I remember. Oh, remember. What the fuck's going on with these member berries? Randy, you're yelling at a Whole Foods. Go on, get out of here! We know! <laughs> Others will know! It isn't going to be so easy. Not anymore. the end of the vid i hope you enjoyed it if you did you remember to leave a like on the vid remember to subscribe to the channel and you just enjoy your life peace